Hey everybody, before we start this episode, since Heritage Distilling is the focused uh, distillery of the month of October, he has a special deal for all of you viewers. So for viewers of Nerds Drink Whiskey, uh, I'd like to invite you all into the tasting room in Gig Harbor uh, and give uh, free tastings uh, through the month of October uh, until October 30th. Uh, just mention Nerds Drink Whiskey and that you saw this podcast and uh, come on down. All right. So, free tasting at the Heritage Distillery. All you have to do is mention Nerds Drink Whiskey, but the deal expires October 30th. Don't come in there on Halloween night. You got to do it before Halloween. That's your deadline. Now on with the episode. Hey everybody, Nerds Drink Whiskey. Uh, we're still down at Pints and Courts, uh, as we always are on the last Saturday of every month. If you want to come down, uh, they do a monthly whiskey tasting this month. Their featured whiskey is Heritage Distilling, so all the whiskeys of Heritage Distilling. And uh, if you were down here, you could have tasted them with us. So uh, last Saturday of the month, come on down to Pints and Courts and Lacey and uh, do the tasting with us be here for the filming we we have a small audience here but uh you know we'd like a larger audience so uh anyways this uh this time we're doing we're, we're revisiting the uh bsb uh we did a quick tasting at the south sound spirits gathering but this is going to be a kind of a more in-depth tasting so uh here we go bsb from heritage distilling That's exactly the way I remember it. Liquid candy. This is uh, totally a dessert whiskey. And uh, speaking of flavored whiskeys, uh, uh, which is next week's episode, uh, this is definitely a really good, this is, if you're gonna do flavored whiskeys, this is the way to do it right, I think. I don't know, uh, what, what's your thoughts? So this one here is actually the batch number 12, and then it's added with a, um, cinnamon and brown bourbon or a brown sugar um, infusion with it so you get that sweetness right off the bat it's a very sweet it's almost liqueur ish type of feel with it um, uh, the nose it reminds me of just like fresh baked um, cinnamon buns really to be honest um, and then the taste that follows is pretty much the same thing so this is very much it's like a candied liqueur almost it would be great um, like an after dinner liqueur something to relax with um i can imagine pouring this over vanilla ice cream and just enjoying it like that very good um yeah cool uh so uh i think this is a, a thumbs up for uh, bsb but uh, keep in mind that it's not a not a typical bourbon not something we usually review this is much sweeter uh but uh this is definitely a dessert whiskey so uh but uh, uh i think uh, are you the one that called it uh i can't remember which one of you called it off camera uh, Cinnabon in a bottle right yeah it's we we refer to it as a gateway whiskey um, for those that don't typically like whiskey it's kind of a, an introduction uh, personally my wife hates whiskey um, but she actually loves brown sugar bourbon it's uh, you know one of those things it's like I said it's a gateway uh, gateway whiskey all right cool so uh, anyways this is your last chance Email us at nerdsdrinkwhiskey at gmail.com or post it on our Facebook, facebook.com slash nerdsdrinkwhiskey. We want to know what your thoughts are on flavored whiskeys. We're getting into the flavored whiskey season, and uh, this is a, be a nice kickoff to it. So the last Saturday of October, uh, we're going to the episode we're going to air is going to be your thoughts on flavored whiskeys. So uh, email it to us, just a short video. Keep it very short. Email it to us, nerdsdrinkwhiskey uh, uh, at gmail.com or facebook.com slash nerdsdrinkwhiskey. Show us your thoughts, and that's what Chewbacca thinks. So, uh, anyways, see you next week. <laughs>